Hey guys, Jimmy here and welcome on board to the GNS GTR LM for a lap of the Indianapolis Road Circuit in preparation for the VEC 6 hours of Indy. So coming round the last corner now onto the pit straight, getting very close to the wall on the left there. Coming across the start finish line now to start a lap. Up to nearly 200 miles now before T1 looking for the first braking marker. And there it is, anchors out, down to first gear. And try not to touch this kerb on the inside, it'll upset this car, but these two kerbs on the inside and outside are nice and flat, so they have no bother. Now for turn 3 and 4, break in a straight line to make sure the car doesn't come round from the rear, and hug the kerb on the right to prepare yourself for turn 5 and 6, a very fast chicane, so here's 1 kerb, 2 kerb, and 3 kerb. Good exit out of there means you'll get up to about 170, 175 miles an hour coming up to turn 7, breaking at about 250 metres. Watch out again for this kerb on the left, it's very high and will unsettle the car. Now for this middle section you have to modulate the throttle and brake to make sure the car behaves. And for this little right hander here you have to make sure you don't cut too far on the inside or you risk getting a penalty, which is very bad for your race. Now coming up to the last portion of the course, getting up again to about 150, 160 mile an hour before braking at about 400 metres in this car nice and early. Very hard right hander here, again a very big race curve on the right, trying to touch it. Now late apex for this left hander. Try to keep the car as tight as possible to minimise wear on this fast right hander coming up and leading back to another lap. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you for the race on Saturday. Details below in the description.